My name is Richard Mungo, and I'm a pediatric dentist and working with Special Smiles here at uh, Special Olympics. Um, you know, it was about 15 years ago, and a friend of mine, uh, that was a co-resident of mine in Boston, uh, many, many years ago, was in charge of this, this whole function. And he called me up and asked if we could start up uh, a series here of Special Smiles with our Southern California group. So I said, yes, I love the challenge, and that's how it started. Uh, my biggest challenge is making sure that we get enough uh, volunteers. So we go to all the universities, USC, UCLA, Western University is fantastic. And uh, that's always a challenge, but we always end up with plenty of help. The ultimate goal is healthy athletes. That's what we want to see. And, you know, we've discovered oral cancer in a couple of patients. We've had a lot of other things you just think, wow, I mean, did you ever notice that? Never, but it was, it's, yeah. So that's our, our thing. One of my favorites is we were at the uh, uh, Summer Games in at uh, Long Beach State University. At the and so I had some of my students from USC that were with me. And um, I like to make sure that the students, you know, we work in this little bubble here of healthy athletes, but they don't get out to see what's really going on. But if I want them to get the true story of Special Olympics, you've got to go out and watch the athletes. So I took a couple of them over to the, there's a big pyramid over there, and that's the basketball facility. You know, athletes going back and forth playing basketball, and all of a sudden, two of them run off the court, run up into the stands, give me a big hug, and run back on the floor. Now, there were two former patients of mine when they were little kids, hadn't seen me for years, but what a pure and simple activity that took place, that interaction, that I'm here to place all you know, my sports, but oh, oh, and then run up and give you a hug. I mean, that's what it's all about. And I was so happy my residents got to see that. I would say to them that this would be one of the more rewarding experiences of your life. It's, we all give to the community, we're all out there, but you, you don't have that venue where you can actually interact with those that, that you serve. To be a part of this is truly an honor. And this to me is the crown jewel of all because we really get a sense of, of need. We understand the need. We get a sense of being able to interact. And one of the big things we do is when we see pathology, to, we're able to connect them to somebody in their community. So I just think it's a wonderful experience for everybody.